Hello everyone and this is Inayat Mir with my Microsoft Exchange 2016 video. So let me brief you about this video. We are going to create a simple disclaimer rule. This will be again a simple disclaimer rule for your employees for everyone who sends and receives email. So, very first we will go and look at the snap-ins from the left side window of your Exchange 2016. So, we don't have to do anything with every snap-in. So, my focus will be on mail flow only. So, once you see all snap-ins, you can go back to your uh, mail flow option. But we are going to set up a rule, a new rule. So, click on the plus sign and create a new rule so you have to provide a name to the rule whatever name is appropriate for you or for your organization then you can choose apply this rule to now here you can customize i am going to apply this rule to all messages so select all messages then you can do the following so you scroll down, you have to append this disclaimer. So I am going to choose the last option, append this disclaimer. Now we have another option where you can enter the text. So you will uh, choose the default uh, wrap option uh, that will align your message in a uh, appropriate format also you need to add a text so what disclaimer you want to see so here uh, you will not be able to copy and paste as i see here uh, you have to copy and paste because i am physical to virtual environment so i am using a different facility to copy and paste the disclaimer so this email and any files transmitted with it are confidential and intended solely for the use of the individual or entity to whom they are addressed if you have received this email in error please notify the system etc so once you apply this rule you will see a warning message but a rule has been applied now you can look at your mailboxes so i have a couple of mailboxes here so we have the, these all recipients so from here you are going to use a user which is going to send a message to another user so i can use any account so i, I will use adam and i can use my own account email or in a yatmir so to send and receive message so to do so you have to go use your web browser and access your outlook so this is existing logged in account so i will log off and uh, it is an administrator uh, credentials here i am going to log in back and use my own account email and password now what i'm going to do here select a time zone once you are done you can compose a new message so i am going to compose a new message so far this is my new brand new mailbox and brand new account you won't see anything here no coming or no going any message here you don't see it i'm going to send this test message which is a disclaimer or verification to Adam so write any sentence you want to just for informational purposes once you send the email you could see your sent item so there is an email sitting there which was in a sent folder now we can go log off and log in back as Adam and you will see this disclaimer so again i am putting this note here so you can align and adjust your disclaimer because 
I am showing you just a simple disclaimer. So, now you can see disclaimer which is a regular format. So, please change it when and as you need it. Thank you for watching this video. So, I will see you in my next video. Bye.